A group of Sydney vets are giving up their time to make sure animals living on our streets stay as healthy as possible. Homeless pet owners often can't afford expensive bills, but a wonderful new community service is giving their best friends the help they need. This is Roxy, and she's not feeling very well. We'll get you better, hey? Her owner loves her, but he simply can't afford expensive veterinary bills. Roxy is one of thousands of dogs owned by the homeless or people who battle to make ends meet. I get really upset when she's um, unwell and when I, I get upset that I can't afford sometimes to take her to the vet. That's why Sydney vet Mark Westman and a group of other volunteers started Pets in the Park. It was just something I started thinking, who's looking after these animals? And when I realised that really there was no one out there taking care of them, I felt like it was some small contribution I could make with my skills and my time. He had the idea while travelling India, treating six street dogs. These are people that genuinely love their animals and these animals play a huge role in their lives, but they just don't have access or the resources to have the veterinary care that they need. For dogs like Lucky, it means he receives veterinary treatment free of charge. Isn't that right, mate? Pets in the Park meets on the last Sunday of every month at St John's Anglican Church in Darlinghurst. To be eligible, owners need to be referred by community services. Many live on the streets. They love them very, very much. They're everything in a lot of cases, you know. A lot of people have hit rock bottom and that dog is always there. Roxy's treatment worked. She received medication from the vet and is on the road to being a healthy little dog. Mike Duffy, 7 News.